How to easily deposit and withdraw money at online casinos. Many players believe that it is the casino that decides how easy it is to make deposits and withdrawals in and out of players' accounts, and to some extent, they are correct. The reality is, some casinos have put a lot of effort into making the payment process as smooth as possible for their players, while others have not. For the most part, the casino's core markets will benefit the most from easy and hassle-free payments, while players in other markets will have fewer options, sometimes resulting in a more cumbersome process. The difference mainly boils down to which payment methods the casino supports, as well as the user interface for deposits and withdrawals. Other aspects of the process are something casinos have less control over, such as transaction processing times and delays caused by mandatory anti-money laundering checks. The latter is what often causes the most delays, especially with withdrawals, which many players find frustrating, and understandably so. But if you're looking to have the most stress-free experience possible while depositing and withdrawing funds from an online casino, then there are some handy tricks you can use. What they are and how they work is what I'll be sharing with you now. If you're mainly looking to get fast transactions both in and out of your casino account, then the payment method you can choose is utmost importance. Generally speaking, the fastest option will be e-wallets and cryptocurrency. Using these payment types will give you almost instant deposits and withdrawals. That means you can start playing with your funds as soon as you have completed the deposit. And when you want to make a withdrawal, there are normally no transaction delay for that either. There is no real transaction time to speak of, as it should be instantaneous. So the delay will occur on the casino side as they check the request. Of course, you'll have to check the terms of the wallet you're using, but this is generally how it works. For other payment methods such as debit and credit cards, bank transfers, prepaid options, it's quite normal that you still get instant deposits, but the transaction time for withdrawals can be as long as several days. This is all up to the payment service provider and not something the casino can influence. That is, other than making sure they have the right payment options for players from your country, since local payment options tend to be the ones with the shortest transaction time. Other than choosing a quick payment method, you should also choose one that supports both deposits and withdrawals, by making sure that any winnings get paid out in the same payment method you use to make the initial deposit, you'll save a lot of hassle when you want to make the withdrawal. Casinos will require that the withdrawal is paid out to the method the deposit came from, and it's only when that is not possible that it will let you use an alternative method for your withdrawal. When your funds are going out to the same account that it came in from, there are fewer mandatory anti-money laundering checks needed from the casino side, which means the payment processing time is quicker. This is often referred to as a closed loop transaction, which is quicker for casinos that offer automatic withdrawals, which means that no one at the casino has to sit and manually process your withdrawal. Instead, it gets automatically approved once you request it. Another aspect regarding payments at online casinos that many players find frustrating is verifying identity. Casinos do this through the process called KYC, which stands for Known Your Customer. At this point, the casino will ask you to send in documents that show who you are and where you live, namely via piece of an ID and proof of an address. In addition, you might be asked to verify the ownership of the payment methods used on your account, especially if you're not using the same one for depositing and for withdrawing, or you've used multiple deposit methods. When the casino will request these documents from you will vary depending on which country you're playing from. Some players will get asked for these documents as soon as they sign up, while players from other countries can get asked at a later stage, usually in connection with a withdrawal request. No matter when the casino asks for these documents, you'll have no other choice than to send them in if you want to keep playing at the casino and get your withdrawals processed. So trying to avoid it or delay the process will get you nowhere. This is because this is not something the casino has any say in, and it is part of the due diligence to combat anti-money laundering and for fraud prevention. It's also something casinos need to do in order to keep the gambling license. So the quicker you can comply with a KYC request, the faster you can get your winnings paid out. While I'm on the topic of extra checks performed by casinos, I should also mention that smaller withdrawals are often processed quicker than the larger ones. So if you want to expedite the withdrawal process, try to keep the requests under 2,000 euros. This will work at some casinos as it is below the trigger point for more careful scrutiny by the casino's risk, fraud and anti-money laundering team. If you're a high roller and often make large deposits and withdrawals, you might also get quicker payouts because the casino may prioritize you if they see you're constantly playing with large sums of money. However, if you're playing with large amounts, it's likely that at some point you will be asked for a source of funds verification. This is so that a casino can verify that you're playing using funds you have obtained legally, to a certain it isn't tied to any money laundering efforts. However, neither the identity verification nor the source of funds verification is something you have to do on an ongoing basis, as most players will have to do this once, 
and then they're done. So this was a lot of background information as to why the payment methods you choose can be important and which aspects can cause a delay in the process. Now let's get to how you actually deposit and withdraw from the casino. You'll start by going to the cashier section of the site when you're logged into your account. This is always prominently displayed on the page, more often than not in the upper right corner if you're playing from a desktop. You'll then see all the different deposit methods available to you and once you've made your selection, you enter the amount you want to deposit. It's often at this stage you're able to enter a bonus code or select a bonus if one is available to you, so be sure to check before you start your transaction. You will then enter your payment details such as an email and password for your e-wallet, the card number, expiry date, the name of card holder for deposits using debit or credit cards and any other information needed to start your transaction. These details are often saved for future deposits, so you won't have to repeatedly enter your information. Once this is done, the money will be made available in your account and you can start playing. After you've played and won, it's time to make a withdrawal. And once again, you need to go to the cashier section. The option for withdrawals is usually not as prominently placed on the website, so you might need a few more clicks to get there. You then enter the amount you want to withdraw, and this has to be within the withdrawal limits of the casino and for your payment method. You'll withdraw to the method your deposit came from, and then all you need to do is sit back and relax while the casino is processing your payout. If they need any kind of account verification from you at this stage, you'll be contacted by the casino with the instructions for how to get verified. Once that's done, everything checks out, your winnings will be paid out to the method you entered when starting the withdrawal. Easy peasy. If you enjoyed this video, stay tuned for more industry related news, casino reviews, as well as tips and tricks. The best way to stay informed, of course, is to like this video and subscribe to our channel. We're adding new content daily at goodluckmate.com, so be sure to click the link in our description. And remember, always play responsibly.